Hi, I'm Rick Kittles, co-founder and scientific director of African Ancestry. You know, in my travels uh, around the country, I meet a lot of people and many of them have the same questions. And so I thought it would be a good opportunity now to answer questions that you may have. Some of you are wondering, what do I do as a geneticist? And what I do is I study DNA. I study DNA in the context of family history, ancestry, but also in terms of disease and disease risk. I focus my genetic studies on people of African descent. And so the experience of African Americans is one where we're very mixed genetically. And because of that, we have to understand ancestry in order to understand how family history and genetics impacts our health. And so for me, studying ancestry was along the same path as studying health and disease for African Americans. One of the things we study is prostate cancer. It's uh, what we call a health disparity. Much more common among African American men. Black men die from it in numbers uh, higher than any other group. And so we're trying to understand what is it about the genetics, the DNA of African people that's increasing the risk for prostate cancer. Another thing that we're studying is colon cancer and, and breast cancer. We're looking at uh, type 2 diabetes and hypertension, all of these health disparities. What's interesting is that many of these disparities have very little to do with DNA or genetics and more to do with social cultural uh, uh, factors. And so we have to understand how DNA plays a role in terms of risk for disease, but also how it interacts with the environment to impact risk diet, lifestyle, behavior, all play a role. So this has been my, my lifelong journey, of trying to uncover the ancestry of African Americans so that we could have more information and stronger uh, tools could be developed to help us in terms of health.